This tutorial focuses on the enhancement to the desktop view preference that allows you to customize the color scheme in QuickBooks 2014 and add colored background to the icon bar. QuickBooks users are again able to customize the color scheme in their QuickBooks company file and add color to the icon bar. This will make it easier for customers that manage multiple companies in QuickBooks to differentiate their company files and icons that are used for shortcuts to QuickBooks functions. After completing this tutorial, you'll be able to customize the color scheme in QuickBooks and add color to the QuickBooks icon bar. For this demonstration, I'll start at the home page. I'll open the Edit menu and select Preferences. This will open the Preferences window. I'll select Desktop View from the list of options to open the My Preferences tab of the Desktop View. I'll click the Company File Color Scheme drop-down. I'll select Blue Medium from the list of options. This option will help customers differentiate when they are managing several company files in QuickBooks. I'll click the OK button on the right-hand side of the Preferences window to save changes to the color scheme and return to the home page. Now let's look at how QuickBooks users can add color and light background to their icon bar in QuickBooks 2014. The option to add color and light background will only work when the user selects the option to display the icon bar at the top of their screen. I'll click the View menu and select Top Icon Bar. The icon bar will now be located across the top of the QuickBooks screen. I'll click the Edit menu and select Preferences. I'll select Desktop View from the options on the left to open the My Preferences tab on the Desktop View options. I'll click the box to put a check mark in the Switch to Colored Icons light background on the top icon bar checkbox. I'll click the OK button on the right hand side of the Preferences window to save the changes. The icon bar will now have a light background and icons will have color to make it easier for users to differentiate the icons they use for shortcuts to functions in QuickBooks. This concludes the demonstration. You're encouraged to try this exercise on your own. If you get stuck, watch this tutorial again and try again on your own. Thanks for watching.